What is going on, everybody? This is Last City Slum here, and we are back with another D2 Weekly Reset video. How are you guys doing this Tuesday, man? It's uh, it's been a crazy, weird little weekend for me, man. But I'm glad, uh, I'm glad it's over. Glad we're back to the work week. So let's uh, actually, I want to take a second, man, give a shout out to um, to my family at XSV. Thank you for everything you do. Faded, um, Tatum. We got Captain Duke Beard over there. Um, Brooklyn Jake. There's a whole lot of people, man. I just I, I want to thank you all for everything you do and 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 thanks for helping me out, Faded. Thank you for the constant support and uh, positive words. And uh, if you guys are looking for a great community, man, full of gamers and content creators, man, check us out at the link below. Um, XSV is an awesome place to be, man, and I I, I can't imagine being anywhere else. And I also want to thank my family at home, too. My uh, beautiful fiance, Last City Looney, and uh, my beautiful dog, Penniford. Her name's Penelope, but every time she's in trouble, it's Penniford. So. All right, enough of that stuff. Let's um, let's go ahead and check out and see what's in the store for this week. Step on up. Take a look. All right, so. As soon as she loads in. Alright, for the shader we have chrome stock. Which is not it's not too bad, man. I kinda actually like the way it looks. I mean it's 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 a lot of blue. I love blue. But I think it's it's a it's a pretty good shader, man. Then we have the pyramid entrance. Not a huge fan of, but Ooh, Pragmat Harrier. Fen Church, there's a lot of fantastic things. Uh, yeah. It's not too bad. I tend to believe him. I kind of like that. kind of like the dropship look. We're going to the Lion Tamer. We are. Get back. No. You know, my mascot being a, uh, a lion, it would be pretty funny. Looking for I have to end up picking this special? one up. Give me some more brat dust oh a lot more alright let's go ahead and drop down here we have the crow projection then we have the symbol of rule it's the uh, the ornament for the scepter and that comes in at 1250 we have looking out oh I love that. I love how when you look, she got the little eyeballs going around there. <laughs> oh man, I am a sucker for goofiness, man. I really am. I uh Yeah. You know. I picked that up. I love that. We have the Neiman Helm. All right, then we have no one there. fell swoop. It's not a, it's, it's I really kind of actually like the way this thing looks. It's, um, it's the, it's something that I think that, man, if they were real, you'd actually see it, like, it's not a far out design, it's sleek, you know what I mean, I, just, I think it looks good. Then we have the junkyard shell. You know, man, you throw... I'm going to try something out here. You throw a pretty good shader on it. You could check it out with the Take fact that it's all like. rusted. I can make. You know what I mean? Maybe you make it a little brighter. It. See, it's got potential to be a good-looking little ghost show. doesn't have to have that crappy rust look. Give it that weird texture that shader brings. Uh, or make it wood. <laughs> All right, so let's go down here. Oh, wait, we got one more up top. My fault. Straw dog standoff. <laughs> All right, then we have the happy entrance. Harpy, harpy, not happy. My <laughs> apologies. I guess I'm a little too happy this morning. 
My uh, fiance made some really good coffee, so I'm, uh, I'm all jazzed up, ready to go. Ossified entrance. This looks like a donut to me. Yeah. One of those crawlers. Take as long as you like. Donuts. I can wait. Okay. <laughs> AI calm. Just reboot entrance. We have Nectar Dynamo Shader. A very bright purple with some reds and some blues. And some like white or gray. We have Vertigree. Then we have Deep Sea Jaunt. Which, man, I kind of like the blue carbon fiber. I wish it was... Uh, you know, like, uh, I don't know, man. I wish the red wasn't in there. I wish they did, like, the blue carbon fiber with uh, some different colors other than that red. And then another shade of blue. You know what I mean? They could have they made this so much better. But it's a good one to have. <clears throat> then we have Celestial Dome. Which is another pretty good shader. Alright, let's go back up top. And we have... Uh, Sales of Osiris. Not a real big fan of these kite ships. You know what I mean? They're just they're they're weird. They're weird to me. Um, we have the Archangel Show. For those of you who are trying to complete your Archangel set, remember last week we had the ship, and this week we have the shell. I'm just really into that whole, <clears throat> what am I thinking of, uh, like, killer carbon fiber, uh, stealthy Warframe, not Warframe, but Warmind look, Warframe, sorry about that guys, War, Warmind look to these, <laughs> to these items, man, so the ship, uh, I'm not a real big fan of the armor set that they came out with whenever there was the whole big deal on Mars, like, that's, a little weird, which I might also unlock that one too, just for S and G's, but shits and giggles. Uh, Rochambeau, rock paper scissors. I don't know you guys, but every time I hear the the term Rochambeau, I'm always thinking about Cartman kicking someone in the nuts. It's in the nuts, in the nuts. Every time. All right, slow jam. Not everything Fenchurch oh. sends is safe to sell. That's it. This one's for you. We're going to get this one, bro, bro. <laughs> Osteraptor. I, um... <clears throat> Somebody can leave in the comments below, man. If you've seen this or have this, I want to know if this laser pointer actually works. Looking for something this laser pointer can. actually works, man. I'll pick this ornament up, but that would be... I think it'd be kind of... A, cool little thing, man. But I like the look... If, God, if I just used the Hawkmoon more, man. Like, I would definitely, without a doubt, grab this, because I just... I like the look of it. I really do. Alright, let's see, uh... Wait, do we get... I'm just gonna double-check this. See if we got anything extra in here. And we did not. Okay. So that's it. Ten weeks of that, huh? Let's go over and check out and see what Banshee's got. See what uh, kind of mods he has in there. And then we'll check Ada Juan's. So, <clears throat> for Banshee, he has Radar Tuner. Radar immediately returns when you stop ADSing. Quick Access Sling. Swap weapons much faster for a short duration after emptying the magazine. Now, these weapons will stay the same all week long, but their perks will change every day. So, starting out with false promises, we have we have Eye of the Storm. So I hate when this thing does that. This really irritates me so bad, man. Okay, Danger Zone for the memory interdict. We have Danger Zone. Blast radius of weapon increases when surrounded by combatants. Underdog weapon gains a boost to reload speed as your health gets lower. Spike grenades. 
high explosive ordnance and we have smart drift control and countermass with a handling masterwork next we'll go to Behringer's memory with a elemental capacitor increased stats based on the currently equipped subclass solar increases reload speed arc handling void stability and stasis Marley controls recoil and increases movement speed when ADSing and of course my favorite not so much fill prep then we have thermoplastic grenades augmented drum we have smart drift control linear compensator with a blast radius masterwork all right moving on we have the number which I could never get a good roll on this at all all right sympathetic arsenal reloading after a final blow also reloads stowed weapons surplus increases handling reload speed and stability for each charged ability Ooh, I see my buddy ricochet rounds down here we have ricochet rounds alloy mag see, look at that boost on ricochet for the range of stability is nice if it wasn't I'm about to check back tomorrow because I like the surplus sympathetic arsenal ah not so much all right polygonal rifling and full bore with a handling masterwork Uh, let's see we'll go ahead and check out the nature of the beast with dragonfly hip fire grip accurized rounds extended mag fast draw and true sight with a handling masterwork not really you know I am a fan of nature of the beast I know I know not a lot of people are you know I don't not huge in the PvP and uh, but I'll tell you what Look at a hand cannon, man, with Dragonfly. And then you got a hip fire grip. Increases accuracy, stability, and precision hit targeting when firing from the hip. Not as well as the last word, I'm sure. But precision frame, recoil patterns in this weapon are more predictably vertical. Fires quickly with high accuracy. So, why not? You know, I think. You know what? I'm doing it. I'm getting it. Long Shadow. Long Shadow Sniper Rifle with Outlaw. Snapshot Sights. Now look, this is probably not a bad couple of perks. You know? Uh, steady Rounds. Alloy Mag. ATD Raptor. ATC Rex. Then we have a Range Masterwork. Not, I, uh, and here's what's weird. Here's what's weird. <laughs> I like to play Breakpoint. In a couple of the games, and um, I'm slowly starting to get to where I'm really enjoying. I run a sniper rifle and an SMG or assault rifle, and I'm getting really like really comfortable loving the sniper. I just don't know if I could ever convert that joy into this game. I don't know if that's something I could do in here. Is they are way more sporadic in this game with their movements. It's it's I don't know. Those other games they're geared around taking your time, and and this one it's 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 fast-paced action and uh, not a bad thing I just wish I could love sniper rifles in here like I do on the mother games sorry about that let's move on to the next one false promises does not want to show me what it has today okay so we're looking at I have the storm and overflow okay um, yeah these other two rounds here I'm not sure what these are God, I, that looks so familiar to me too as well I don't know what is up with this you don't look too banged up. let me know down at the bottom too man if this ever happens to you guys or if it's just like just my stuff <laughs> alright Eye of the Storm Overflow Extended Mag Armor Piercing Rounds alright and Polygonal Rifling and Chambered Compensator with show me stability masterwork just out of a 360 I was gonna pick up a 360 man it just would not be false promises you know it's I don't know somebody's running low on oh, space okay so let's go down here and we will go check out and see what 801 has I thought I was freaking I need to clear out my vault guys I've got like I'm almost a full vault I keep doing that I just shove everything in there until I'm maxed out and then I go through and delete what I think I don't need 
by that time it's still halfway full <laughs> when i'm getting low on them legendary shards man i need to redo it again here pretty soon all right let's go in here we will see what 801 has i'm praying she has something good but you know Hello again. all right mod wise mod wise not mod wise mod wise <laughs> we're looking at sustained charge Be Come charged with light by rapidly defeating combatants with auto rifles, trace rifles, or machine guns. Additional copies of this mod increase the time allowed between combatants that are defeated. Then we have shotgun targeting. Improved target acquisition accuracy and ADS speed for shotguns. Now, for the Titans, we have the Devastation set. Um, and all of these are completely trash perk-wise. So it's really just going to be a good starter set or it's gonna be for your transmogs you know it's it's that's really your call and um, you know I think that's it for the week I didn't see anything else popping up whenever I logged in this morning about you know this week um but I just wanna let you guys know man that I really do appreciate you guys stopping by and uh, I appreciate you guys who subscribe and uh, if you like what you see please hit a like if you don't, drop a comment and let me know what we can do a little different, you know, to, to tailor it to, to people's needs or, or to what you want. You know, I'm always open to a lot of things, and I just need the, uh, the help seeing saying what it is. So, I really do appreciate you guys. And uh, until next time, this is Last City Slum saying I hope you guys have a great week and be kind to each other and love one another, man. Have a great one.